What is going on, my good people of YouTube? This is MK The Truth, D O D B E N T. Got a another upcoming pair of sneakers for us to look at today if you guys are new to the channel come on and join the family also connect to my instagram it is the underscore truth underscore mk also ladies and gentlemen all music is produced by me dodb and it will be uploaded on this channel as well so let's go ahead and get a look at what i got first things first people my reviews are for educational purposes only this is mk's analysis and then we're jumping on up out of here let's take a look at what i got i do have another pair of the beautiful upcoming reimagined edge on threes let's see what these hitting on love the box love the old school inspired box go ahead pop the top on you and i already see a problem <laughs> you copy the paper down to the photo credit on the paper god boy <sighs> could have at least tried to black that out anyway let's get into the rest of this and we have one of my favorite upcoming shoes the edge on three white cement reimagine okay we looking pretty good man we are looking pretty good a little bit boxy a little bit boxy a little bit high up here but I'm going to tell y'all, if there is one inconsistent shoe out there, it is the Air Jordan 3. <laughs> Some of these early pairs I've been seeing of these, I have been looking. They look boxy just like this. So I, I don't know what's going on with JB, Jordan Brand, or what have you. But they don't, like the Fire Reds, have that just classic old school small elephant print on the toe box. This looks like we're getting some of that boxy shape all over again. Anyway, we hit a look at this beautiful looking sneaker. Love the vintage old style hits on the midsole. Like I've done this shoe already before, so it ain't too much uh, of anything that's different that we need to go over. Um, I will say it is still a little, a little bit boxy in the front, but like I said, I've been seeing some of these early, you know, these early authentic boys and uh, they look boxy as well. Like I tell y'all, everything is inconsistent and that is just not to push things in my favor. Anyway, the leather is looking pretty good up on the top. Very nice. Love the vintage style hit there. Got a little bit of red there. Leather, once again, move that shoe tree. These will not come with shoe trees. They are pushing paper in there and I think paper keeps a really good shape to the shoe anyway. Anyway, these are looking pretty good. Not too bad. Not too bad. Maybe a little bit heavy on the elephant print, but not too bad. Not too bad. Love the sail down at the bottom. Had a little bit of a light sale. Well, this is more of a cream. This is like uh, this is like sale right here. Love the gray hit with the red on the bottom. Flip around to the medial side. Go a little bit of schmutz. Got a little bit of schmutz right there with the black eye stays. Very nice. But yeah, this is this is just too boxy. It is dropped properly. It's dropped properly, but it's just lacking. It's lacking in that shape department. Give me more of that. Give me more of that. Not that. Anyway, not too bad. Not too bad. Nike Air on the boot. That nice cream. Very nice. You can see the paint strokes in the midsole there. Elephant print is a bit heavy on the black. I think I can't remember. I think it is a little bit heavy on the black. But y'all know MK don't care about that. With that quality and craftsmanship looking like. And it's looking pretty good. Just a little bit boxy in the front. Let's take a look at this other shoe right quick. And man, just like I suspected. When you got the split panel here, you're going to, well, this is probably, this looking like one whole piece, but keep in mind, people, you will get some pairs where you'll have a heavy tumble like this right here, and you will barely see any at all on this side right here. So keep that in mind. That's a split panel right there. But anyway, these are looking pretty good. We get dropped properly, but we still having this sort of a boxy cut in the toe box area. Nonetheless, they don't look too bad. The leather is always just primo primo leather you got the hang tag with the nike air orange we won't get the beads this time we will get a piece of plastic uh on the uh hang tag this time uh so keep that in mind but overall very nice on the quality just the shaping but i can't really say that for the shape because a lot of these early pairs i am seeing from y'all look just like this anyway let me know what y'all think about these down below this is mk the truth d-o-d-b-e-n-t Hey man, I love y'all. We out.